Factsverse presents 7 Everyday Things That Are Badly Designed Number 1. Christmas Lights For decades, people have been taking their Christmas decorations out of storage. Each year, they have struggled. Unless you're one of those meticulous people, you put your lights in a box until the next season, and when that season comes, you would need to work for what feels like hours trying to untangle those stinking lights! If you try to turn them on and they don't work, that's because one of the lights is burned out. You need to replace every light with a new one just to find the bulb that's out. It's often easier just to buy a new string of lights, am I right? When Christmas lights were designed properly, only the light that's burned out would fail to work, and the rest would be lit. They'd also come with a built-in spool to keep them from getting tangled. Number 2. The Microwave Keypad When most people use their microwave, the only buttons they use are the numbers. The Start button, the Stop button, the Defrost button, and the Power Level button. Many microwaves have buttons, but people never use them and they don't even know why they're there. The average microwave has over 31 buttons. Many microwaves have a popcorn button, a frozen pizza button, a beverage button, and buttons that list different types of fish and vegetables. These buttons are completely useless, and they just cost the consumer more money for their microwave. A study was performed that showed that 92% of the people questioned never use any buttons other than the numbers, start, and defrost. The rest are useless. Someone who makes microwaves should come out with a model with a more simplified keypad. Number 3. The Juice Carton It's extremely difficult to open a juice carton. Years ago, milk and juice they came in these containers, and since then, many milk manufacturers have switched over to containers with handles and covers. This is because the carton can be very difficult to open. If you don't open the carton right the first time, well, it's almost impossible at that point to open it without needing to rip it open entirely. And when most people struggle to get the carton open, well, they switch to open it on the other side. Well, if you can't open it from this side, it's going to be hard to open it at all. Well, many juice manufacturers, they still use the carton, but they added a twist-off spout on the top. There's even a company who came out with a spout that you can force into your container so that you don't even need to bother with opening the carton at all. The milk and juice companies who are still using the cardboard opening, they should catch up with the times. It'll make their customers' lives a whole lot easier. If companies are inventing products and changing their packaging to make opening the carton easier, then others should do the same. Number 4. Umbrellas Most umbrellas work great, as long as it's not raining and windy. If the wind blows, well, it can lift the umbrella up and turn it inside out. And when that happens, you'll get wet and the metal pieces of the umbrella bend to the point that they break off. Some people believe that umbrella companies create this design purposely so that you have to go and buy a new umbrella on a regular basis, while other people believe that there's not been an umbrella company yet who can come up with a better alternative. Well, there are, however, some umbrella companies that are working to repair this design flaw, and we thank them. Number 5. Economy Airplane Seats If you're flying coach, chances are you're not going to be very comfortable. This is due to the design of the seats in coach. Everything works fine until you get to the headrest. It comes out really far, right at your neck, which causes you to keep your head pushed forward for the entire flight. The seats have a slight C-curve, which doesn't go with any person's normal body contour, and by the time you arrive at your destination, your neck is killing you from sitting the wrong way. You can slightly correct the problem with a neck pillow, however, it would be better if airlines were to just replace the seats with ones that don't have a headrest to start with. If passengers want to rest their heads, they can ask for a pillow or they can bring their own. Number 6. The Cereal Box Whoever designed the first cereal box deserves credit for creating one of the seven everyday things that are badly designed. To open the cereal box, you need to open the box top carefully to be sure that you don't tear it. Next, the inside bag that contains the cereal needs to be opened carefully to be sure that it doesn't rip. After you've poured your cereal, you need to put it away correctly or else the cereal will go stale before the next time you eat it. Many people forget to fold the bag down to keep the cereal fresh. Many cereal manufacturers they count on this so that consumers have to replace their stale cereal more often. 
There are plenty of more efficient ways that cereal can be packaged. Only time will tell if a company will ever decide to think of one and put it on the market. Number 7. The Bra If you ever look around at bras in the store, you'll see that many of them have cups that are attached with a cute little bow. Well, according to my wife, this makes no sense. Apparently, no women have breasts that are separated that far apart. No woman's cleavage is that large. When a woman wears this type of bra, they'll find that the top of their breast pops out of the cup because that little bow doesn't give the cups enough support, and that can result in the woman's breast looking misshapen. So next time you go bra shopping, ladies, regardless of how cute that bow looks, buy a bra without the cute little bow. It'll make your breasts look normal under your clothes. And isn't that what we're striving for? Subscribe for more!